Okay, folks, this is Chris Oteron checking in for Trade Tax Plus Center of Excellence. This is the second video for June 2019, the second technical video, and it deals with a very simple issue, I guess. The question we received is export goods. In terms of an indirect export, and I opt to apply the standard rate to that invoice, but I have to issue the invoice, the tax invoice, in the foreign currency. Would it be okay if I only reflect the VAT amount in South African rands? Now it seems like a simple question if you look at the proviso to section 20 subsection 4 of the VAT Act. Um, allows some leniency where invoices are issued in respect of um, foreign, uh, two foreign recipients and where the, the consideration is charged in the foreign currency. But that relaxation only applies where it is a zero rated supply. Now keep in mind that the moment you opt to, uh, to apply the standard rate to indirect export, it's not, an, it's not an export, it's not a zero rated supply, it becomes a normal standard rated supply. And the uh, normal disclosure rules apply to such an invoice. So um, the simple answer then is that it's not a standard, it is a standard rate supply, it's not a zero rated supply, so the exclusion or the, ex, the, the relaxation does not apply, and all the monetary amounts, the value of the supply, the consideration, and the VAT must be reflected um, in South African rands on that invoice. If you also want to reflect the foreign currency amount, you're most welcome to do so. But um, the primary disclosure requirements relate to. Um, local supplies standard rated. Okay, so simple, but sometimes you just need somebody to to have a look at the detail of certain sections and, and guide you towards what why the answer is what it is. So I hope you enjoyed that. First time to run, checking out for Trade Tax Plus Center of Excellence.